Through evolution, we learn how to heal. Inflammation is a part of natural healing. All three processes – inflammation, repair, and tissue remodeling – are healing responses of the body to an injury. Say you sprained your foot or torn the muscles. There is a physical damage to the ligamentous and muscular tissue. Their cells are ripped off and the content leaks. But the body knows what to do. To flush the debris out and remove bacteria, blood and lymph flow to the site of injury. Blood is necessary because it brings essential nutrients, oxygen, and removes waste. Red light therapy improves local blood circulation via dilated vessels and better collateral flow. It's also known to reduce inflammation, which speeds up healing. Once the site is clear, coagulation seals the vessel and bleeding is stopped. Food becomes hot and swollen. Hot because of the high metabolic rate, which requires energy. The blood flow to the injured site is disrupted, which causes low of the oxygen production and therefore low ATP production. The clever body is trying to do everything possible to redirect energy to this damaged site, which would struggle to heal without it. Now imagine what happens when people are ill or fatigued. This lack of energy will slow healing process right down and often results in the injury becoming chronic. Red and infrared light from the flex beam generate this very energy assisting faster natural healing. Pain often is sensed due to lack of oxygen in tissues. When you use flex beam, pain can instantly drop since local blood flow is increasing, bringing more oxygen to the damaged tissues. During the second stage of repair, the body creates scaffolding, temporary bridges integrating damaged tissues. This is essential in building up a framework to repopulate this area with new cells. Using the flex beam at this stage is as important as during the inflammatory stage. Apart from better blood flow, it boosts collagen production, helping healing of the scars and adhesions. The last stage is called remodeling, when scar cells are replaced by the mature cells of the tissue that was damaged. This phase can last up to two years. Red light is known to promote stem cells like fibroblasts, myoblasts, osteoblasts and cellular maturation and is known to have zero side effects. That is why I recommend using the FlexBeam targeted red light therapy device to aid and optimize all stages of healing and ultimately assist in your recovery.